Intel's newest Centrino mobile technology is updated on the platform codenamed Santa Rosa. Its four components are a wireless device, a chipset, turbo memory, and the processor. Karen Regis is an engineer in Intel's mobile marketing group. So the processor that we're going to be um, using in the Santa Rosa platform is the Core 2 Duo processor, which we actually introduced in August of 2006 in the mobile space. But we have um, vamped it up. We've added two new features for, for performance and two new features that are going to help with the power efficiency at the same time. So you're going to get a better performing part um, on the Santa Rosa platform, faster front side bus, um, a mode that allows you to go up one bin when you are running single threaded applications. Last year, notebooks outsold desktops in the U.S. for the first time ever. The research group IDC predicts that laptops will overtake desktop computers worldwide in five years. I think that with Centrino, the first platform that had the integrated wireless capability, we saw a rise in the attach rate on, PC, on notebook PCs go from 5% to virtually 100% of PCs are wirelessly enabled. And it really was um, a tipping point. It really became the new norm. Now what we're doing is we're just raising the bar on ourselves with what people can do with that wireless. With our new offering, which offers um, draft end capability, we're going to see up to five times the throughput and um, up to double the coverage. So the other thing is that in our integrated graphics chipset, uh, we have a brand new 3D graphics engine um, built in, and we have new technology called Intel Clear Video Technology that's actually um, a set of technologies that can take um, any content, standard definition content, and clean it up to give a clearer, sharper, um, more vivid video playback. So there is one other optional component that we're going to offer on the system, and it's called Intel Turbo Memory. And what it is is uh, NAND flash um, and a really smart ASIC chip. Now this ASIC chip um, can actually kind of keep track of what you're doing on your computer, see what applications you're using the most, and preload them into this memory that sits a lot closer to the processor. So you can load those applications faster and run them faster by having them closer uh, to the memory. Intel prepares the Santa Rosa demos in this lab at company headquarters in Santa Clara, California. The lab sets up the new Centrino technology on laptops from a range of manufacturers. Jeff Lowe has the job of preparing the machines. He makes sure the systems handle diverse applications, from video to business software. New advances in Centrino mean better wireless connectivity, lower power consumption, and improved security and manageability. Centrino Duo is aimed at consumers. Regis says Centrino Pro is built for business users. Uh, we have um, manageability and security capability that is essentially what we introduced in the desktop space and our v v Pro brand last summer. We're bringing that into the mobile space and we're cutting the wire on manageability there. Have you ever gotten to your PC and it won't boot in the morning? It, it just doesn't want to wake up for whatever reason. Well, this one does require a wire, but if you can't boot, um, you can actually call IT. IT can remotely boot your system over the wire from a remote management console. The machine is constantly checking to make sure that you have your security agents on, to make sure that you don't have a virus um, and that you're not going to infect the rest of the network with a virus. PC manufacturers are now shipping laptops outfitted with the new Centrino platform. But the mobile technology is also finding its way into desktops. Intel says Centrino is one reason why PC designers are bringing to market quieter and smaller desktop PCs. I still want to just oh, touch it. <laughs> it looks so real. Yeah.